Okay, welcome back to another episode of Oxygen Not Included. So, uh, quickly off camera, I have just laid this down. Um, we need oxygen for our uh, exosuits before we carry on into this hot biome down there. So, as a temporary measure, we're just going to put a gas pump there. It's going to be right above uh, this, which is giving off oxygen. And that will let us feed into there. Um, what we do need is a filter, um, which we have got as our research selected, the gas filter, just so we can make sure that we are only pumping oxygen into our suits. Um, it will work um, sort of on this setup, but if we keep pumping um, gases that aren't oxygen into the suits, it will damage them. Um, which does cost us resources to keep repairing um, so that's you know that's obviously not ideal um, but as a temporary this is just going to be a temporary system um, further down the line probably up here we will build a proper um, oxygen system um, using the electrolyzer um, that will also give off hydrogen, so we can uh, use that up in one of um, one of these, the hydrogen generators. Um, so we're not quite at that point yet, so I thought if we just do this, at least we can get these built. Because um, really, that's now hindering our exploration in all directions. There's lots of germs and things around, so we are going to need these suits before we carry on. Um, I do want to crack on and uh, get these uh, this water system done. They're already on a six, so we'll put them up to a seven, um, just to get those done. Because we did discover last time that we have got germs in our water supply. Um, I'm not really sure where they've come from, to be honest. Um, I'm guessing it was probably off here because that has been decontaminated. Um, so that's not ideal because obviously that's going to go into our food and things. We're okay at the moment, but obviously that's the water we're using to um, to water our plants and things. And obviously that's going to transfer the germs there. Um, so yeah, I, I mean, it, it, are they going down? 938... No, they look to be uh, staying the same, really. Um, I mean, we could heat heat this up, and that would kill the germs, but obviously then the water would be really hot, and that would make the base really hot, so that's not ideal either. Um, but it's not really causing a problem at the moment, but I'd like to get them out of there before we open uh, this new water course up, because that could... Um, could just sort of keep the germs there for a bit longer which we, we don't want so that's the plan anyway um, yeah so we, we have got um, an exosuit uh, we've got four of them built there by the looks of things which is good so let's request uh, request those there probably get this done as soon as them suits are ready put this on an 8 uh, just to get it done um, so we have been in here and got the reed fibres off, off these here which is good um, we did have a seed of that but we couldn't seem to plant in, um, in the farm Ah, so they will, let's just see, so it will let us do it in the farming tile, but no, it's not letting us, uh, definitely not letting us grow those in the planters, um, so let's plant that, I'm going to have to get rid of that in there, can get rid of that grow what we want in there so really we should probably have dug that down uh, into there actually it seems like they're covered in germs if we uh, deconstruct that dig that out we should then be able to uh, 
uh, just lower that down. This is somewhere that's not got the gems. That's... We'll put it there, I think. So what do these need? They'll go in anything. So they'll actually grow in our normal area. So I don't really know why. I tend to only find them in sort of polluted oxygen to start with, but they don't actually need that. Yeah, so they will grow anywhere, which is quite interesting. We'll put it in there then. We will put it. Um, did it say they're growing carbon dioxide? Let's have a look. Carbon dioxide, yes. Well, we'll put them down here then, I think. Let's dig that area out. Dig that out. Uh, food. Farm tile. In there. It's only a quick job, so we'll get that done on a nine. That can be uprooted. So what we could actually do is uproot these two as well, these three here, and put them down here. Once we get this one growing, we'll maybe do that. Just just so that they're a little bit more uh, accessible for our dupes. Fantastic. They've started from the bottom, which is fine. What's the oxygen like down here? So it's not ideal. We could maybe do to um, actually put a vent coming off um, office just to give us some oxygen down here, I think. Put that there. Um, we'll just do a normal pressure one, I think. Cause we're not. I don't want it cramming full, so that's running power up to there. And yeah, I think last time, yeah, we jiggled a few things around. So with with this generator here, that's got 120, 40, 600, a 40, 960. So that one's now full. Whereas this one. Um, we've now only got uh, 240, 360, 420, I think they're 240, 420, 660, so we should be able to get um, definitely two of those going, if, if, if not all three. We might be able to squeeze squeeze a third one on there we'll just have to see I have read somewhere that I think if you go over a thousand now on this wire you get damaged quite early whereas it seems to take a while before um, so we'll have to see and I suppose everything's not going to be running at the same time all the time um, certainly the food they're not using that all the time so we'll see what happens with that I think um, and yeah we wanted to move this this sort of wall is too close to this ladder, so we want to move that back um, on here, didn't we? That one's deconstructing. Station. Research station. Put that one there. No one's brought this as yet. Hmm. 
Why is that? It's on a nine. Someone should have brought that. We're all quite busy doing this. Oh, that's only on an eight, so it shouldn't really be a problem. Speed them up a little bit. Try and get things done a bit quicker. Ah, so they can't get to that. That's why that's like that. So if we open this, they should now. Yes. So we obviously locked them out of there to stop them picking up uh, this sandstone that he's eating. So that's on there. Irrigation and body temperature. Body temperature shouldn't be a problem, I don't think. It's at 28. Ah, so they need polluted water. That's interesting. Hmm. That's maybe why it was best left up here somewhere, because I think, although I don't think they've got... Additional domestic growth, life cycle two cycles. So I think it should grow without... So, we need to build one of these. Plumbing, pitcher pump. So if we can put that onto there. That will sort that. Deconstruct that. And what's going on? Is that letting out oxygen? No. Let's just move that up to an eight. Uh, move that up to an eight. They're obviously doing other jobs and uh, forgetting to sort their oxygen out, which isn't good. That's got that going again. That's fine. They've got rid of that. Uh, is that going to let us? So we drop it down. Let's see. Hopefully that will get that done. So we're nearly done with this. A bit of a uh, little bit of wire left there, and then we also need to run a power cable up to here. We want to come off here. For that, please. Thank you. That seems to be working. Oh. oh, it doesn't seem to be spreading anything. We'll just have to keep an eye on that, I think, because it says that the polluted water... So, actually, we might be better to put them in the bottom of there, maybe. Let's see. It's not a not a big issue at the moment, because we, we've got the suits we need for down here, and he's just put his on. Fantastic. So they're now saying that they've not got enough of two. So where are we up to? The pipe all seems to be done, so it is just the wire. So that's not working for some reason. Let's try again. Let's try that. There we go. Let's get that done. Should be our soup set up then. Just need to make sure that that stays loaded up with algae and such. Oh, come on. Starvation. Who's starving? Uh, okay. We've got food, so they're obviously not. 
Who's our cook? Harry's our cook. Mopping, harvesting. And what would be good, um, it's maybe available on the workshop, is on Rimworld you can set people with different priorities. So like we've got the priorities uh, for what they do, you can actually set people's individual priorities so it would be good to set for in this example Ari as a nine for cooking but then she'll do or he they will do other things when there's no cooking to do but cooking will be their first priority um, I guess if we I guess if we set that to a nine it should mean that they will always do that first hopefully um, yeah we've an awful lot of an awful lot of stuff ready for them to harvest they're obviously just not getting around to it with the other jobs we've given them ah so that's that's starting pumping that uh, where are we up to it's coming through just to start and fill these up with oxygen um, and we can carry on down here. Crude oil. Let's see what we can find down there. Um, now, in the past games, going up has always been the best place to find geysers, steam geysers. Um, I mean, that would be quite interesting to go that way. How many. How many suits have we got? We've only got another one. But I suppose we could move one from the bottom so that we've got two to play with. Um, do we go this way or do we carry on going up? I think we should go up. So that's, that's the way we're going to go. We're going to go up. So let's get... Um, Stations, exosuit, checkpoint there, exosuit dock. We'll put two in and we'll leave it at that for now, I think. Um, and then probably put an airlock door on that side. Don't know if we're going to fit all this in. No, we're one shot. Typical. Um, if we put that there. And then. Hmm. And if we put the wash base in there. ideal but um, at least everyone's then going to wash their hands sort of as they go up there um, we could come this way but then it's going to let all this chlorine out we could kind of come that way but then it's I guess we could move the airlock actually I love started now he'll be fine it's fine not a problem Yeah, we maybe should have actually just put the sink there and moved the airlock so that it was it was there. But um, oh well, we live and learn. They've started on it, so they've started. So we'll let them continue. I'm gonna have to get rid of another one of those so they can fit up that way, which is a little bit annoying. So she's going to be stuck now. Come on, carry on on this. Hmm. Where 
feel gone. Come on, do some work. What have we got here? Loud sleeper, no. Noodle arms, not ideal. Medicine, construction, may could be worth a bit of look at. That all looks okay. Anemic, This is slow. I think we'll go with this one. May come along. So that now takes us to nine, and we've got uh, ten beds. So we're one, one left to fill there. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we're fine in the dining room, and um, one, two, three, four, five, one, two, I have a six there, sorry. So we've two more spaces. Okay, and you can see now that, so these two, they've no oxygen, so we can't use them at the moment. And this one is filling up. Have a look there, oxygen, yeah. No, it's going up, which is good. Um, it has got some germs on it. That's a bit odd. I don't really think they've been anywhere with germs. Oh, there is some down there, but we've not got down to there yet. So I don't really know where them germs have come from. Hmm. Don't know on that one. How are we doing here? Yeah, so we've still got them germs in there. Disinfect. Can't do anything with them. That's all okay. So that's working now. A little bit, a little bit backwards, but um, <coughs> it's it's fine. It's, uh, it serves the purpose, which is fine. So we want that as they're going out, basically. How are we doing with this? Yeah, so we're cracking on with this at the moment, which is good. Let's get that done. So this is one of them occasions where potentially that, I don't think it would have done, but that's where things have fallen down and it, and it sort of mounts up and you have to redig it. It's really annoying if you're not paying attention because they can get trapped and then they suffocate and yeah, it's not good. So Lindsay, why is Lindsay not doing anything? So Lindsay is our artist, so we need to add her, I think sweeping, just having someone sweeping up is probably quite good. So there's quite a lot of stuff around the place, but she can do that. We'd like to get all this out of here, so obviously all this water's going to sit in here. Um, can't get to them, so we're going to have to put that in there for them. Seven. And then at least this door can be kept locked here uh, until we use all this up and hopefully the germs will disappear. Probably want to bring this a little bit lower down as well. Um, one, two, yeah, probably down to here, I think. Bring that down to there. Probably don't want to do that until all this water's um, gone, because obviously this isn't going to reach quite that far down. So this can all be swept, please, by our sweeper. How are we doing for coal? 50 tonnes of coal. We're doing really well for coal, which is nice. 
and he's still got 15 tons to eat there and he's still got 15 tons to eat there so that's really good really really impressed with that and that's nice and full really really happy with how things are going on this uh, got these set up that one's nearly full so once that's full it will go to there and that having that vent there has sorted out its oxygen situation which is nice um, hopefully that'll just push push this up to here and that'll get rid of it um, gonna need to look at a carbon skimmer at some point as well um, just to, to just get rid of some of this carbon dioxide but we, we are more than happy with how we're doing it at the moment um, yeah and that's really good by using the uh, just the normal gas vent rather than the high pressure one um, it's not going to keep just pouring out and pouring out and popping the rear drums and all that um, really the most important thing for this auction at the moment is to get into these suits um, so that more of them can, can get down here and see what we've got some really interesting noises coming from down here so I'm really excited to explore and see what's what's down here I don't know if it's this fella that's making the noise yeah it probably is um, but there looks to be some nice crude oil down here as well so we can we can get into that uh, soon so there we go so he's gone past the sign got a suit so let's put that on which is really good um, yeah I'm really happy with how things are going food um, yeah food could be going a little bit better I guess I don't think more sort of um, plants will be needed. We've got quite a lot there. Um, but then I guess maybe we maybe we should. I suppose they're all ready for harvesting and they're not getting done. Um, but a lot of a lot of construction still going on. Um, so that's that. And again this is where sort of sand has dropped down but actually we'll that's already on a one anyway but I'd rather them get uh, swept up before we let the water out and then, then we can uh, let that drain down then we need to look at how this is going to come down here um, so we'll probably We'll go two to there. I'm just conscious that we're probably going to expand into that space. So maybe bringing it this way is the better idea. And then take that down there. Now that down there. Just so we can. We don't really want it to spill into there, do we? Um, we'll have that going all the way to the bottom just in case. And then at least they can get all the way through if needed. Obviously, we'll we'll set it so they can't come that way. Um, and then yeah, probably there. So we'll put another door on here, and then that can fall down there and into there, which is really good. And as we expand, it'll just keep this area clear. They're on with that now. We'll find some more water or a steam geyser. Excuse me. <laughs> uh, brilliant. So yeah, so that one's now full, and we're a long way on to that one. So we're doing really happy with how that's working. We've got them nice and early. Um, just just looks after the duplicants, which is good. And then this is nice and breathable down here. Um, and, and as that sort of works its way up, it should um, push this carbon up, up to here. Um, get a little bit of a build up up there actually now. Um, so we probably could do with another one of these. How are we doing for algae? Um, okay. 
Now where are we going to put it? We've got one there. Hmm. I suppose this is only temporary, because once they're full, that, that up there will stop, um, stop sucking it down here. I'm wondering if we should, for the time being, disable that one, because two suits is, is more than enough really for, for what they're going to be doing, um, and you can only actually have one at a time working down certainly as we're going down that way anyway um obviously it's full look at all this oil here there's loads of it it's really exciting um so hopefully then that will stop putting all the oxygen down here um yeah i mean we could put a um a valve on here and that will just slow it down a little bit um because i'm just getting a little bit concerned about this. That, that's okay, that's that's not really getting any you see now. Obviously up there is all carbon. Um, yeah, so I think what we'll do is if we turn that round to there, have that going down to there, that into there get rid of that, put that on a 9, and then we'll just uh, just slow down a little bit, um, just slow this down a little bit, just so we can get some more oxygen in the base, because it's obviously all going straight up there, which, which isn't good, although we want to try and make sure there's only oxygen going into there, um, we don't want it taking it all, so this is giving out... Um, 500 gallons a second, and this, uh, uh, so it has stopped now, so if we have a look, ah, uh, it stopped because we've broken the pipe actually, yeah, let's run again, let's get that one done, Come on, get this one done. It's on a nine. Someone do it. Fantastic. So if we put that down to a hundred, it should then. Yeah, it's just gonna just stop that a little bit. If we have a look on here, you can see. These are, um, no, fine. it will just mean that these will back up a little bit. I mean, we've got, is that polluted oxygen or carbon dioxide there, which isn't ideal, but there's just nothing we can do at the moment. Oh, I suppose we have now got this, um, so that's good. We have now got the filter, so we could do something. Um, if we do that there, just conscious of our power situation, um, so that will go out to, we'll do that high pressure because we don't want that to slow it down, and then we'll have to get rid of that, and then we can just put that back in after, that and a nine. Also going to need power, which is an ideal. I wonder. We said that was full, didn't we? I don't really want to introduce a third. Although we're going to have to for up here. Um, I'd rather the the carbon be kicked out here rather than if we put it up here, it's going to kick out the nasty carbon dioxide up there, which isn't really ideal, at least down the bottom it's already carbon dioxide down here. So we'll give this a go and see how see how that works. Uh, we've got the power. I suppose we're not really researching anything at the moment. 
fossil fuels, we probably need to get the oil refinery done. Sanitation, no. Clever how much is no. Insulated tiles would be nice. Um, decontamination, possibly. Not really going to use them at the minute. Hmm. Probably not much of a need to get any of this done, although I suppose if we want to start using the oil. Um, and that is going to give off natural gas, so we can probably get that piped into one of those as well. So we'll go for the fossil fuels, I think, because power seems to be, <laughs> as usual, what's going to be the issue. I just don't really want to keep building loads of these. I think the last time I've played through, I ended up having something like six of, of these. Um, probably even more, actually. Maybe even ten. Um, which wasn't ideal, so... Um, yeah. Let's now just go to there. So gas pipes, so this is where the nice stuff or the, the filtered gas comes out of. So choose your filtered element. We want uh, oxygen. And then basically, so whatever comes in goes in there. Out of here, it will kick out the oxygen, which is the orange. Uh, color and anything that's not oxygen that has come down here will get kicked out of here uh, so probably polluted oxygen and carbon dioxide uh, at the moment because again you don't really want polluted oxygen going into here it will break them so that's, that's not really what we want again it's just wasting resources um, that looks like Still not actually done, is it? So why is it doing that? Still the odd few bugs. And I think that's going to be a <laughs> bit of a bug. I can't understand why that's running when nothing's going into it. Hmm. Come on, it's on a nine. Get it done. Chop, chop. going to have to do something with this carbon next. So, I think we'll probably open this out, which will hopefully just let everything move down a little bit, and then we'll get a um, carbon skimmer uh, in here. It doesn't, I think it needs, does it need, it needs water in, so clean water, and it will give out dirty water. Um, probably also need to be mindful that that's quite a small tank, so we'll probably bring that down to there, the same as that one. Just to keep everything the same, and then at this side, it's probably a good spot for another farm. We'll maybe grow these in the hydroponic uh, tiles though. Again, just to cut down on a job, it just saves it just saves us having to manually water them. Uh, oops. Roll that out of there. All that wants to come out of there, so we probably can't do that yet. Fantastic. That one's cutting out. That one's cutting out. And hopefully that'll just keep things circulating. Probably actually moving these in as well um, is an idea. Just hopefully to let this oxygen circulate a little bit better. Because at the moment we've only got two sort of spaces. Having that other one will just let things. Uh, let the carbon fall down and hopefully let the oxygen move around a bit okay i think we'll leave it there for this episode thank you very much for watching don't forget to click like if you've enjoyed the video and make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss any of our next videos thank you very much for watching and we will see you next time